is Albert Reed and I'll be presenting our work on the topic of creating physics-based machine learning algorithms for synthetic aperture sonar. Synthetic aperture sonar, or SAS, is a technology primarily used to, for capturing high-resolution images of the seafloor and used in applications such as automatic target recognition and oceanographic research. Unfortunately, the costly deploy deployment of SAS imaging systems limits the collection of SAS data. This lack of data bottlenecks the research of data-driven machine learning for a wide range of applications in SAS imaging. We present two thrusts of research which work towards compensating for this lack of data by coupling physics knowledge with machine learning in order to develop high-performance SAS imaging algorithms. The first thrust uses a hybrid pipeline of an optical renderer and a generative adversarial network to create realistic-looking SAS imagery which could potentially be used for dataset augmentation. This work was published in N MTS IEEE Oceans in 2019. In this paper, we utilize an open source optical ray tracer called Pavray to render SAS approximate images. Using the renderer, we can rapidly create image tiles of cylindrical targets on a noisy background. Then, given a small dataset of real SAS images, we use a generative adversarial network to transform these optically rendered SAS images to have the same visual and statistical qualities of real SAS images. We perform this transformation by minimizing an energy-based distance function between our transformed images and the real data set, while preserving the content of our re rendered images by enforcing a feature loss. With this pipeline, we were able to generate a high number of visually realistic SAS images of targets on the seafloor using a relatively low number of training images for the GAN. Here we show the rendered approximate SAS images in the first row and in the second row the result of the GAN transforming the images to look more SAS realistic while preserving the content of the rendered scene. We show real SAS images in the third row for reference. In the full paper we explain that many of our generated images reside in a nearby feature space of the images of real SAS data. Thus, we propose that these images have the potential to enrich, enrich existing SAS datasets and increase the performance of neural networks for object detection and classification tasks on SAS images. Our second thrust of research aims to leverage differentiable programming to make SAS simulation and processing differentiable. Our goal is to create a fully differentiable SAS simulator that has the potential to couple with existing deep learning optimization techniques for a variety of application and also perform inverse imaging tasks such as differentiable rendering. Currently, we are developing a differentiable SAS point scattering simulator in Beamformer. Next, we demonstrate the potential application of our differentiable SAS simulator for solving inverse imaging problems by using analysis by synthesis. Say we are given a beamformed image of a 3D scene, denoted here as chi. Here the given scene is comprised of a set of points that form a cube, and we wish to recover the cube position. We, we wish to recover the 3D position of each of these point scatters using an analysis by synthesis optimization. We begin with an initial set of hydrophones H, which are assumed known, and initial guess of points X hat in the scene. We simulate the transmission and capture of acoustic waveforms interacting with arbitrary scene geometries using a ray tracing approximation of the sonar wave equation. We then implement a differentiable delay in sum time domain beamformer for viewing the scene's reflected acoustic intensity in the spatial domain. This process yields a beamformed image for our initial guess of point positions, denoted chi hat. We can then calculate a loss between our simulated image and the given image and backpropagate through the simulator to update our initial guess of point positions towards ground truth. The completed optimization yields a close estimate of the point scatterers that form the image. We illustrate a 2D example of this optimization here. Given a beamform SAS image of points that form a square and an initial guess of points centered in the middle of the scene, we perform the analysis by synthesis optimization to recover the point positions. Currently, we are extending this optimization procedure to solve ill-posed problems such as recovering 3D point positions from 2D beamform scenes. While these results are shown with simulated data, we are working towards validating these results on a real in-air circular SAS imaging system in our lab. Thank you.